Well, it's it's good in terms of a TV. 430 TV up is very good, isn't it? Um, he will get Eldrum and a Wizard, probably. Mad Mike, BB. He's got, oh God, he's got an art. He's got a plus armor warden, so that's all right. So he's only got 11 men. He does have agility 5. He does have the wizard. He's 8 1 1. The wizard could be crucial, but he's a level 15 coach, so hopefully he's a bit of. But he's 18 1 1, so. Hmm. Yeah, not too far away from Top Chaos. But this could be a loss, couldn't it, with uh, with a wizard? The wizard can just be crucial. It is a great record for someone who picks armor. Yeah. Because <laughs> wood elves aren't overpowered, Valene. <laughs> it, is, it is a pretty great matchup. It's just, it's always dodgy with a wizard, isn't it? You know, that's the... It is a great matchup, but... Elves with a wizard. An Eldrill, or whatever the else they get. He hasn't even got a tree man, alright then, tree man, wizard, something. Still, it can roll dice, can't they? Wizard and Nudge 5 is bad times, absolutely. I mean, look, I can see the point of plus AV on, on war dancers. But I probably wouldn't take it <laughs> until I had movement 10. <laughs> Man with a skill. Willow Rosebark. Wow. Well, if this stays like this. Oh, God, this is glorious. Not even a wizard. Oh, glorious. Glorious. <laughs> and he's got money in the bank that isn't applying to this game. So, like, he's actually 50 TV more unspent effectively. Wow. Wow. No wizard at all makes it very favourable, I think. With a wizard, it would be banana skin, wouldn't it? It's still a banana skin, really. You can still you can still one turn and stuff, you know, there's still it's still not done. I can still roll bad dice. Exactly, Valenic, they can still be bad dice, but Willow is not the way to win, in my opinion. Mm. Let's receive and then he might concede. Just bang on him. I'm going to have to put all skills on because I can't tell who's catches really. Guard tree. Yeah, it's just not anything. It's basically take the wizard and then decide how to spend the rest of your money, isn't it? <laughs> that, that is what I would be. That was I. That's what I'd be thinking. Eldrill's a bit shit though because he hasn't got block. So like, it, he's dicey, isn't he, Eldrill? I'm not that. I'm not that fussed about Eldrill to be honest. Like, he can be good. He can be good, but I don't think you would definitely want him. I just think you would definitely want the wizard, and then decide how to spend the rest of your money. I uh, would probably want a star just to get twelve players, or a tree man. I I I, I don't hear getting the tree man. I don't think I'd pay 50k for a skill though. But I don't hate getting a tree man. But yeah, I just think. I don't think you have to get babes or apples. I just think you have to get a wizard and then think about everything else. But just the wizard. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Pedro. Just take the wizard first and then everything else can be down to personal um, preference. But the wizard cannot be. <laughs> the wizard is non-negotiable, in my opinion. 
especially when he's got agility five. I just go for a claw on him, I think. So he'll move in, and then he'll block, and he'll block, and he'll block. Let's defend against the Blitz first and foremost. Yeah, guard. Oh, he's got a kick, but not an award answer. <sighs> Man. That's actually pretty good. Although I didn't want to really follow up. Means I can blitz and retreat, doesn't it? And uh, maybe keep keep a bit of a screen here. Blitz him, but then he could have just blocked him out of the way. It's not good, is it? That double score was annoying. Into the into the both down as well. Yeah, she's a dryad, yeah. Who do I want to level? Strength 4 guy, I guess, because he's on 25, isn't he? Needs a pal here, though, to break through. Lucky. Pushing the wrong square, so he's not going to break through. Interesting.
Yeah, I would have done as well, Wolf Bark, yeah. But... Yeah, maybe just a bit. Oh, there you go. Right. But I can, I can blitz him. Blitz him with a claw pom. <laughs> Or block him with claw bomb. Blitz this guy. And then assist with him as well. Classic, classic punching of a tree there. Can't be based. And with eight move, he can get into a cage easily, can't he? He could go one forward. Got no frenzy, has he? I've done the classic new play of congregating around the tree here. Yeah, look, the claw pom is seventy-five percent to knock him over and 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 claw pom him. It's too good, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. As long as Woody's are content to hang back. And like, it, they're still just like strength four doofuses. They're not that good when they're not assisting. I don't think. But it's claw pom in it. At the end of the day, claw pom is just literally too good against trees. When you're seventy five percent knock them down. If different if you have block. Oh man, he didn't do the dodge through. Absolute madman. Oh, no, it's my tackler, so it wasn't that crazy. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have put him there, eh? But now, now he's now he's done something. I don't get to piss about with the uh, hitting the tree so much. I'm still gonna hit the tree though if I can. <laughs> I guess I shouldn't have moved him one forward, eh? He can two dice him. He can two dice him first. It's 
shame to not call upon him. Because he would have been through it. One assist foul on the ward answer. Guess not, because he's armor right. It's so good not having to care about the wizard. <laughs> well, yeah, I've got 13 men, that's true. Mm. It's fucking tree. <laughs> Cry on. <laughs> it's better than any tree I've ever had, I tell you. I'd try for the foul now. I just couldn't get assists on him. That was why I didn't want to foul him. Not because I didn't want to foul the ward answer. I just thought I can't get the assists in. Whereas now, um, get three days. Completely failed to put <laughs> guard on the cage corners. Bit over to one side, but the tree kind of forces you to go to one side, doesn't it? Why not this with Frenzy Guy? Yeah, not a bad shot. It's the same odds of getting him on the ground, isn't it? 
Or Bleeding Hippie. Um, yeah, there you go, 29.3. Which isn't that bad, is it? If you take four draws off that, it's 22.55. And I think Top Chaos is 25.55 or something. So it's near the top. I don't think he's played this bad at all. He's been lucky, obviously, to have his uh, tree not removed. On, <laughs> or stayed knocked down or rooted. But... Maybe I should have fouled the ward answer. Yeah, I guess I should have done that. It's just that Tackle's got Mighty Blow. <laughs> That's the thing, isn't it? Tackle's got Mighty Blow. Yeah, I just wanted a Mighty Blow. Hidden Mighty Blow. Not good. I think I need to take the tree out. I think it's actually required. Because I can't go down one side, I have to go through the middle. I'm running out of time. Finally. Bit problematic to defend the ball though, isn't it still? I don't want to give him an easy deep in, but I can't help it. He doesn't have that much dodge. He's going to get the leap one dice in this turn, isn't he? Yeah, fell up here, yeah. Has the tree finally? I mean, I didn't want to really just wanted to stun him or just knock him over more. Like, I hit him with claw mighty blow and claw palm and just didn't get him over. But just knocking him over would have been good enough, really, wouldn't it? A stun a stun would have been good enough. I haven't ended turn. Thank you. Uh, Make your pun. Uh. Yes, Jahanian. It also gives you an outlet if you've got no other chance of winning, though, doesn't it? So, 
unfortunately. Um, it's it's going to be his best chance this game, and unfortunately, he's going to have a shot at it, isn't he? Oh, that was unlucky while well, he still got it. I guess he's just going to surf him with a dancer, right? Eh? Yeah, I can't know. Unlucky, buddy. I don't mean, uh, if he'd surfed, though, he can't defend. It's taken three players as well, hasn't it? And I guess I've got a movement eight player, so I don't even need to get that far forward. Which is good. No, yeah, no, yeah. Thank you, Bella. Yeah, I would have been heavy, you're right. I, mean, I can't believe now. I wouldn't. I wouldn't have gone for the surf because he needs to try and defend, doesn't he? And he's left this side. This side is way wide open now. Wide open. So I, I wouldn't be so much tilted by not surfing the warrior as I would have been tilted at not looking at my sheet and saying not try to surf. Oh, I was star player rolling a skull in glorious fashion. Oh god. So good. Oh, this is good, isn't it? So let's blitz him because it gets me moving. He's going to be there. He can be there. Good job, I've got 13 players in this dirty player, isn't it? Oh, cheeky. Match has just been great, yeah. <laughs> it is Willow Rosebark who has like the body of a war dancer with a bit of a a bit of a dryady head. stomp on the but I'd blocked with a dirty player though didn't I so oh shit I exposed the claw pump to a block one block in the match let's see what happens didn't die unbelievable Jeff literally unbelievable
Hmm. I'd like to blitz him, but only then I would like to blitz him, and also would like to blitz him. I blitz him. Could push him twice and block him, but I don't know. Could just blitz this way and get forward. Sadly, getting forward has to be good, doesn't it? No foul. I just have to get forward. What if I go this way? One, two, three, four, five, six. And these guys would get there, but there's more shit on this side, isn't there, I think? Certainly all these are on this side, so they'd be hard to get up, whereas this way they can all get up this way. So I think for that reason, it's up to uh, it's up to this guy. That's a good spot for him between them two, isn't it? I don't hate it. Make another GFI just because I got the reroll. Yeah, boy. He could screen one off here, yeah. Didn't get as far forward as I wanted to, but still. Six squares away. Got two lateral, thanks to the uh, movement eight. No, I just wanted to get people forward and make it tricky for him because as Jelly all said it's not it's not that hard for him to screen well. Yeah, Juhani and Eldril I had Eldril against Ducky and I don't know if he forgot about his pass block and Nerves of Steel, but he went for a pass and uh and I went I pass blocked it, Nerves of Steel, failed the interception and I felt bad. And he ooh, thought he'd got the uh, double power on the uphill, but thankfully not. Could surf him here, just quietly. Just quietly could surf him. Willfully decided to ignore it. Yeah, I mean, that was the thing. You would have gone for the play anyway. It's just... The play was, I don't think you would have done it different if you'd, um, you know, whether you forgot it or knew it, you know. Like, the fact that he had it was irrelevant to the play, that's what I was trying to say. I think it was the optimal play, so it really wouldn't have mattered if you had uh, forgotten or not, because I still think it was a thing, but I was just sad that, I was sad that, you know, I was like, I was loath to make a pass that had the chance of a bull sent or interception and obviously the bull sent or intercepted it and then I had the chance of a I had the chance of an elderly interception and failed it they're okay Gunnarkin they've got they've got uh, strength three sure hands in it against uh, elves and stuff and it makes the one turn pick up and pass kind of more li less likely to have to use a reroll. Uh, block him, block him, block him, block him. I've got to got to go for this surf, haven't I? Because it's just so easy to wear. Uh, 
to blitz for the touchdown. Three, four, five, six. So make this block first. What if it's a push? Okay. Nearly done it. <laughs> Nearly got us. Uh... Hey. Look at your piece of paper. He's got guard, but it could just hit. It could hit the guard guy. Could blitz him and block him. Three dice and catches by himself is pretty great, isn't it? Best for goals on his way. Yeah, the strength four guy on Frenzy would be outstanding. But then he may he, or he may not have set up in that particular instance for it, but it just generally is brilliant, isn't it? He's got catches here. I hate this fucking shit. He's agility five catcher. So he could go for the... Uh, There's only two pushes, isn't it? But I really don't want to give him extra blocks. I think he probably won't go for it or won't know how to do it. But it is just two pushes, isn't it? I'm just going to hope he doesn't know how to do it. Eight one one, good point.
Whew. Close. Eight one one, but also Willow. <laughs> it's forbidden under the CRP. So. Or Henry Judas. Yeah, you'd think, wouldn't you? You'd think you would definitely go for it, but then Willow and. Willow and, yeah, I don't know. But it, plus the fact you can see guides on the internet how to one turn, can't you? So it's like, even in the, even if people, even if people have played like you might think that they don't know how to one turn, thanks to the internet, they might know how to. Oh yeah, the movie, that was Fash, wasn't it? Fash played Willow in the movie. <laughs> Looks like he hasn't gone for the one turn. This is a really fucking weird one turn that I haven't heard about. Yeah, so now I'm just getting good players blocked instead of bad players. <laughs> and giving up a blitz as well. Yeah, he must have been playing for the Riot, yeah. Maybe he's actually played for the Riot. Oh. Willow, not being great. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's fair enough, Felina. That's fair enough. It is, it is a tough, it is a tough defense, to be fair. Fucking Willow. <laughs> Alright, let's go for... Uh, The York Wall. Hitting the guard isn't that bad. Having guard there means it makes it harder to hit him. Hitting the frenzy isn't that bad. Yeah, I guess it's better that he hits the dirty player. Tackles protected. Movement guy's probably more useful than the claw pommer, to be fair. To be fair, pseudonym, it's challenging enough trying to qualify with good setups. <laughs> Ring world. Yeah, I didn't, I've never got anyone world because I only played it when I felt really ill and didn't want to play anything, which wasn't the best time to, to try and play a new game, was it? <laughs> Gosh, cookie. <laughs> oh man, you've got to wear it though, right? Maybe the three guard should have been on the LOS because he can 
he can crack those easily with one guard of his own. So I guess he should have had all three guard in there. On the other ones. Yeah, I mean, obviously this save formation has the strength for on, on the wings, but then I uh, I didn't didn't do that. I've just got too many fucking good beastmen now, haven't I? That's the problem there. Oh, it's a blots. It's a blots. That's Willow, not a war dancer. Not actually a war dancer, it just looks like one. Probably on two safeties. Which would be the frenzy and the uh, tackle. <laughs> yes, you don't know. <laughs> yeah, I realised as soon as I'd fucking moved him, I should have put him side of him so he couldn't get two dice on him, but never mind. Or in there. Yeah, the ball was too far away, I couldn't even threaten it, could I? Job equally, yeah. That's the thing, that's the thing with Skaven, isn't it? Skaven are just like, oh man, Skaven are pretty ridiculous. Skaven take the advantage of like strange things the most, don't they? Yeah, I fucked up not putting the, the dirty player in there, let him to crack that side a bit. But only a bit, thanks to pushers. Well done, flat fat. You fucking can't mess with flat fat, I tell you. Yeah. Um, there is a button there, Coach Cookie, that you can click on. Um, up down below, <laughs> it says donate, and. I don't know what you know, I think you just need a PayPal account. Um, also, you could uh, pledge on Patreon. Sextus Fibre, oh yeah, there should be. There's just Sextus Bones is a warrior, except he's not Sextus, he's Sexton, because I was an idiot. Sexton Bones. He escaped that quite well, didn't he, really?
But I just hope to base him with even more men this time. Can, and can blots his guard as well. various ways to donate. One way that is fun is through cheers to hear this robotic sexy voice. That's U -N -S -K, true. UNSK, 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 UNSK. And that, that's very true as well. Oh, Narnia, thank you very much for the bits. Yeah, that is true. That is a very good, very good shout. Right, this. I need to show this up, don't I? Just meaning a potato down this side now. But. Got the movement eight to sneakily catch him. Like that was the obvious blitz. I thought that he's made. So. I didn't want him to be able to crack open. It's annoying thinking he's got three war dancers, by the way. Maybe I didn't need the second the tackle. Maybe the tackle should have stayed back for the whole half. Shitty. I, I opened up that fucking side as well. I shouldn't have done it, should I? Shouldn't have done it. It's just eating catching. The best part about cheering is that you can make the robot say old memes. I should have just... man now, dog. <laughs> I shouldn't have given him the chance to potato. Well, oh, but then he failed, so it was alright. <laughs> um, thank you, Sir Domin. <laughs> Okay, lucky me, lucky, lucky, lucky me. to cheer old memes, but then I took an arrow to the knee. <laughs> right, so that's okay, isn't it? I'll do that. Shame it's not 3D, 3D but... I was going to get the ball with him, but it would be a GFI now. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, double GFI. Or a dodge and a GFI. But then show hands on the pickup. So I guess it's better to have the dodge and the GFI but show hands on the pickup. Oh my god. One assist foul here. Oh, I've blocked my path, haven't I? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This isn't a GFI, this is just a dodge. Yeah, it's only a dodge. But without a reroll. And then after it, I can foul him. Of course, it was a fucking stun. Yeah, it's still a two plus pickup, but it's dodges through. And I mean, I tried to fucking block him. I blitzed him. Fuck it. I wanted to fucking kill him. If I just rolled that. It would have been alright. Wow, horrible making a scatter there. Horrible play, because he can just catch it now with his elf. That would have been disaster for him. But yeah, I just wanted to blitz him. I wanted to fucking push him or power him or something. Kill him would have been good, wouldn't it? Did you got to jump up? Oh, God. This is all gone fucking tits up. Wish he'd just scored last turn if he's going to do this. Wow, <laughs> he's out of rerolls at least. And he can't stall because of the two, two sweepers. Yeah, push even on the blitz would have been all right. Why not take the chaos? I did take the chaos with warrior block, didn't I? I don't know. I literally don't know what you mean there, Cookie. I did block the Warriors. I double scored it, one of them. Yep. That's fair, Pathless Taken, that is fair. That is fair. That was a pretty important dodge out and go. Because I had to go for the dodge out and pick up. I just had to go for it. Or the double GFI pick up. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Forcing Elsa's crown three turns after using all the rules is pretty good. Yeah, to be fair. It's just they can always fucking leap in and get the get the one dice, can't they? Or a pill. Right. Make it more symmetrical. Protect him. one side tackle the other yeah it seems all right no I'm setting up anti-blitz 
Squirrel dude. This is offense. Why isn't this offense? Champ's ladder. Uh, I like Tomty. Oh, yeah, setting up for a blot. He's back to pick up the ball. He's there to punch him. Call mighty ball. He just wants to push him because pushing is the best way to hurt somebody. Two, three, four, five, six. I'll screen it. I'll screen it up. to get to Yeah, it is a bit different, very low TV, yeah, exactly, yeah, that's true. Not really, no, Coach Kogi. It's, it's a lot different, look, it's a lot different in res, at low TV, r rather than, uh, and just play in general at high TV, defence at high TV, because there's so many skills and everything, the 2-1 grind's a lot easier, isn't it? Uh, you know, you, you you get a lot more tools to score with at higher TV. Um, and there's obviously more attrition and everything. And there's more protecting your players from getting hurt. Like, you know, you wouldn't you wouldn't give up your war dancer to stop a score in Champs Ladder. Because it's not worth it, is it? But you would in a one-off game or whatever. So, it is quite different. A lot of the time you want to do a... I like shepherd them down and let them score in three or four or five, even even in five turns. You know, shepherd them down and let them score in five without risking your best players in a progression environment. But in res, you'd be much better off just stopping them scoring at all. <laughs> so yeah, it's all a bit dodgy and different. Got a ward answer there, hasn't he? Next to a next to a dirty player. Just quietly. Three dice with wrestles can be better than two with tackle, isn't it? <laughs> ah, he's on either side to the dirty player. Shit. I do this one first. Balls.
Maybe it's just two dice in with wrestle. That's all I can do. Classic. Oh, he's got jump up. He can surf. He can surf that guy now, can he? Oh shit! That was a bad square to fall from. Yeah, I should have fouled from here, shouldn't I? But then I wanted to screen off more in the front anyway. But hmm. Then if he serves, he gets counter surf, doesn't he? Gee, if I hit the tackler, that's fair enough, I guess. Yeah, I guess I should have just taken a push, put him against the sideline. Should have known it would be a gym foul. At least I finally remembered the foul in, in the course of the match. But he's going to get surfed now, isn't he? Well, that jump up block has just got him surfed. So, every cloud has a silver lining. Although, should I go for the surf? With only four turns to score? But is it better to make forward progress? Maybe. Maybe it is, actually. Maybe I'll blitz his war dancer here. In fact, I'll definitely just blitz his war dancer here. No surf. I've got my sheet. Obviously, surf on the water and sort of being good. <laughs> oh God, yeah. If I'd, if I didn't have sure hands, I wouldn't have considered not surfing him. Move forward a few squares. I mean that that shows how. How hard the moving forward is, doesn't it?
He's still got a full team, hasn't he? It's crazy. Crazy that he's taken zero removals. In the game, except for that tree map. Alright, that was a pretty, pretty huge fail there, wasn't it? Now I get to move forward this turn. There's the final second remove. Now could even make the blitz here to surf him. Hey! All right, finally. The dirty player could actually go and foul as well, couldn't he? Make this block first. So could make a cage there. Yeah, could. Oh no, that's fuck, he's the one surfing. Fuck, cock shit balls. Be a GFI from him at the end. Outrageous. <laughs> Motherfucker! <sighs> that there is why the sheet says no serves. You can get a one dice on the ball with him now. Lupak was right all along. Yeah, impulsively, but I knew I had to make this GFI at the end. That was the thing. Maybe I should have done the GFI first. Oh, at least didn't one dice the ball. So now I can just go blitz this guy. Might as well do it first. Well, now it's a 1 in 12, 9, 6 to not win though. Bit risky doing it first.
right, so now the guards everywhere, isn't it? He can reach, he can reach easily because he's got jump up. <laughs> oh, I thought it worked. Oh. oh, well, you can't win them all. Should have piled on, yeah, but then that guy wouldn't be based, would he? And... <laughs> oh shit, uphill block. Oh god. In honor of almost killing a war dancer. <laughs> oh, thanks, Grindel. <laughs> To be fair, he can base a lot of guys. Maybe I should have gone down this side. But then my players were more able to get down here. But then I just didn't put that much up the side, did I? Should be able to clear, though, I think. B movement 8 is, is pretty good, isn't it? Means I can uh, block the war dancer and chain him to there and then chain him out and stuff. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. I mean, could just block him, block him, and block him and stuff, but I think what I want to do is uh, try to chain. The war dancer. This is just a two, isn't it? Fuck off, man. So anything but a double skull. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's a touchdown, isn't it? And obviously a pal's really easy touchdown. Even if that had been a push, it was still one, two. Well, obviously it was eight the other way, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, it was easy either way. Um. I guess just don't fail stuff now, eh? With the result in the balance. Phew. You could have made it one die? Nah, it was you was surrounded by guard. Could have made a 3D, yeah, I jelly up, but you know, who cares? But yeah, he should have definitely done the seventy five percent dodging, yeah, for sure. For shizzle. Um 
might as well re-roll it. Nothing bad can really happen, can it? You Guns won the game, but it was an elf game. So we're actually all losers <laughs> for sitting through it. Congratulations. Thanks, pseudonym. Cheers, guys. Um, oh, wow, is he got MVP, the tree induced? Ooh, 30. 30 for the strength 5 guy, holy shit. So close. 20 of he breaks to 3. God, it's good. It's good playing people that don't kill you. To be fair, twice as many blocks. Best fagger got his touchdowns. Whew. All right, that was a pretty good day, then, wasn't it? Three draws and three draws, and three wins and a draw. You won the game, so now you have to lose the next one to achieve fifty percent win rate. <laughs> Cheers, BZL, with a TV plus there. <laughs> So I don't think they were. I don't think they were level ups, were they? But best for go is a touchdown away, or a Kaz randomly. I think he's much more likely to get a touchdown. Judah Fagos three Kaz away, or a touchdown and a Kaz away, and uh, Steel Fagor is like a completion of Kaz or a touchdown away. So I should be able to get him up to I guess frenzy and then ditch Travi Fagor maybe. Because strength four wants frenzy, doesn't he? Really, it's pretty, pretty good. Especially when you beat your strength five on a blitz, on a blots. Maybe just take tackle on him though, and then keep the frenzy. But strength three frenzy, yeah, really. I have problems liking it. Uh, so, and getting getting there on the record. So thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.